This is the Is Joshua YouTube production presentation production. It's the Wan DVD show. And Time for a brand new Riddle DVD showcase. Probably your volume one from the great, glorious DVD company that's East West. Plan to do a whole entire bunch of introductions here. But time to enter the talking room. This show, Poppy Hooper, if you guys don't know, it's created by Jay Ward, created Rock and Bull with Gold, and also a bunch of other random shows that nobody cares about. They have managed to carry Rock and Bull Winkle, but he also created Hoppity Hooper, and that uh, barely even gets the actual love and attention. I'm not saying that it deserves, but it actually deserves something. Rock and Bull is hugely popular, and I guess that's why they got a complete series DVD release. A bunch of other blue leg releases that no one cares about, but yeah, that's mainly it. But Hoppity Hooper, since literally no one knows the show is, hasn't actually had a DVD release, just VHS releases. Well, besides this, and also that Milk Creek Home Entertainment, or whatever it's called, 600 cartoon collection box set that includes a total of 11 Hoppities. Wow. And then this Hoppity Hooper Volume 1 set includes 3 Hoppities. That aren't up there. Plus a random Hunky and Spunky short. What the fuck even is that? And Hunky and Spunky is a random Paramount Fleischer Studios cartoon like Popeye and those old Superman. And um, it's basically all I know. Why is this even here? I guess because Hunky and Spunky is one of East West main brands. So yeah. Also, this random East West DVD company, they basically haven't produced Lily. They haven't produced anything else. I think they produced some of those awful Dango Pictures English dubs. But besides that, literally nothing. Besides this random Mary Had Little Lamb and Other Stories DVD, which I gave to my sister. Um, yeah. I have no idea where the disc or case is, but yeah. Also, all the episodes of Hoppy Hoop are available on YouTube. And the person who uploaded it is probably going to make a complete series set all for himself. Or for herself. But uh, anyway, we're getting off topic. One more thing before we actually get on topic again. The Mary Had Little Lamb DVD includes 10 shorts. But the Had Little Lamb cartoon in particular is the 6th one. So then when you go to the menu and hit play all, it starts from the 6th one. But how do you get to the first one? Well, that'll be explained later. It's kind of weird how I had to explain how to get to the first short. Oh, the explanation now. So, Hoppity Hooper Volume 1. We don't have the case anymore, so in order for you to understand why we don't, go all the way back to the crappy COVID times, which is still going on, so that was a few years ago. We figured out that we have to still go to school and do all these crappy virtual learning. We just find the case all over the place and under the door and stuff, but then the case broke. We had this random red slip to keep the nostalgic goodness. We should still have the nostalgic very high little lamb DVD. That offers way less entertainment value, but... The total runtime of this collection is like 62 minutes. And the Hunk and Spunky Store is probably just slapped in. It's not even a bonus feature. I guess they just wanted to get the runtime to 62 minutes. Also, despite the title, it's not actually Volume 1. It's just three random Season 3 episodes for some reason, like near the end of the series. Not really a Volume 1. There was a Volume 2 with nine random episodes. But according to some reviews, it's just random nine TV broadcast episodes, which would bring it up to a whopping total of 12 episodes. One more than the Milk Creek edition. I think volume two is nine episodes. I know, the point is that this is here right now. So, how and what is the actual DVD? To answer that, I have my DVD player right here. We're going to put this thing in and see if it will actually read. Well, probably. Even though it has a bunch of random scratches, it's still able to read after all this time.
Oh, by the way, while we're waiting for it to load, I might as well just explain how we got this DVD. And one of our cousins randomly had this, and the mirror had a little lamp DVD. So, that explains it. Well, because I handed in the autoplay feature. Mm, wow, well, great. Warnings, my favorite. I don't even want to copy this garbage at all. It just automatically starts. Shitty, grainy film quality and all. Let's go to the actual crappy menu of this thing. Mm. Yeah, great. He has nothing on it. And there's no episode selection. It just says on DVD. You can't even select. You don't even. You can't even select anything. You can't even select everything. Just you look at all the crappy DVDs that's available. Then for website, which probably isn't even up anymore, you get. This takes so long for no reason. Also, Walder's white hair <laughs> should be purple. Anyway, let's play this garbage. Three whole chapters, wow. Have to be quick. And at the end, the end, got a great cameo. Just starts to DVD all over again. Great. The end. Oh my god, DVD showcase. Bye. The bottom says 14. Hoppy and Hooper and friends. Volume 1, but there's no friends. I'm just gonna honk in this book. <clears throat>